in the event of natural disaster, telecommunication companies will try to do the best, but we always need to have our plan in place so we can quickly act on it. And once we are safe, we can look after other people and make them safe. When we had the bushfire, I was working in the telecom industry and went around helping the community out there. With the telecom, I was involved in managing incidents where the telecommunication network sites would be losing power. So we were looking at how we can get power across to them. People cannot always rely on their mobile or their telecommunication. Working during natural disaster, you get very emotional. When you see people hard earn money and whatever they have achieved in life, just go up in flames. And when you hear those stories from them, you start thinking about if this would have happened to me, what would I do? So in the event of natural disaster, telecommunication companies will try to do the best. And also what they do is they work with each other to provide the service to the community. But from our perspective as a community, what I would suggest the community members need to be prepared. People cannot always rely on their mobile or their telecommunication because if there is a major disaster, we might lose some coverage. There might be black spots and you might not be able to contact anybody. So my advice on that one would be always tune into your local radio station and listen into what they are saying and advising you on which path you need to take. The other thing what I've also done is I've spoken to my neighbors and made them aware that if there's an emergency, we should stick together and we keep an eye on each other so that support available for one another. During the last natural disaster, what we identified is that we had some telecommunication network sites that we could not reach and those areas weren't able to be serviced and the damage that was caused also by them, um, it took a long time to get them repaired uh, because it was very hard to reach to those locations. Another natural disaster comes our way. I and my family have sat together. We have made our emergency plan. Being prepared is for your family, your loved ones, then you can help the community out there. For more information, visit www.infrastructure.gov.au forward slash stand.